as well as an air date for the start of season one of the new Doctor Who starring Shuti Gatwa, we got a little tiny mini teaser trailer with, I think, all new shots in. So in this video, I'm going to look at that, break it down and very quickly, just there's not much, just talk about what we see and what it might mean. Hi, I'm Phil. Welcome to my channel where I talk about all the geeky pop culture that I like, including things like Doctor Who. Quite a lot of Doctor Who, in fact, so if you like that sort of stuff, hit the subscribe button, I guess. Let's get straight into this new teaser trailer. I should say, apparently, we're getting a bigger trailer this weekend, so I will cover that when we do. But for now, let's look at this little tiny teaser trailer that we got. The first shot has the Doctor and Ruby exiting the TARDIS. Now, the looks on their faces indicate that this might be the first trip for Ruby. She's got quite a look of wonderment on her face, and backing that up, she is also wearing the same outfit she entered the TARDIS in at the end of the church on Ruby Road. Uh, they look to be outside. There's a bit of a cliff face there. Beyond that, we don't really get any more information from that. The next shot, she says, oh, come on. she's in the same outfit. So this is probably still episode one, but they're now inside somewhere. I've seen people say this might be a spaceship, this, you know, or a space station of some kind. I think it's probably more likely, given it's the same episode and we saw that they've landed outside on a planet, that this is a base on a planet type thing. And then they have found this base and are probably exploring it a little bit. Then we get a clip which is probably from episode 2, the 60s set Beatles episode, the potential musical episode. They're wearing some funky costumes here, very retro, love the hair. Give me a number, give me a year. Now this clip could be at the end of episode 1. Um, he, It's clearly not at the beginning of episode 1 because he's already discarded his coat like we see in later clips in a second. But when they were exiting the TARDIS in that first clip, he was still wearing it. So it could be at the end of the first episode or the first two episodes could run directly into each other and this could be at the beginning of the next episode. Obviously before they change into their 60s gear. Either way, it's probably where Ruby, who remember is a musician, probably says she wants to go see the Beatles in the 1960s. And I gotta say, I love Shooty's energy here. It's it's very energizing. His energy is energizing. Something here is making them jump. And I can't tell if Shooty is grabbing Ruby to protect her or for his own comfort because he's really scared too. I kind of hope it's not the latter because I don't think the Doctor should be that kind of scared. He can be scared, but not scream and grab hold of somebody for comfort scared. He's kind of a more of a stoic, this is really bad, I'm really worried, kind of look on his face type scared. And I know each doctor is different, but I don't think a doctor should be that kind of Scooby-Doo leap into the air and grab somebody kind of jump scare scared. So hopefully it's more that he's protecting Ruby here. It's gonna be a moment. In this one, he's wearing a third costume. So this is probably an episode past episode two. Maybe we're getting clips from the first three episodes, for instance. As for what he's referring to, it sounds kind of like he's in the middle of doing something and somebody is trying to hurry him. So random guess, maybe he's trying to defuse a bomb or something, something with a countdown that requires him to hurry up, but he needs to concentrate on it. Then we've got Kate Stewart. Here it comes. It's good to see Unit back. I saw uh, Richard Lloyd point out that in the background you can kind of see very blurred, but what looks like Rose is probably there. Also, probably this is episode three or beyond again, because episode one is set on an alien planet by the looks of it, episode two in the 1960s. So we're probably going to get an episode three that's maybe modern day where they return back to Ruby's time. And this is where Unit can come in. Is Rose working at Unit now? Why is she there? I mean, she still should be a teenager. I mean, I doubt they would have employed her, but you never know. Maybe the time jump is larger than we thought it was between the specials and this or maybe she's just there visiting her mum we know that Donna was offered a job at unit so maybe she took it and maybe she's there maybe we'll see her maybe we'll see Donna as well the doctor here is looking with a look of shock through glass he's in his episode one outfit so we know it's probably in that base on the planet and we know 
from other things that have been released and talked about that there is a creature called the Bogeyman in this episode. That's potentially what he's looking at here. Either that or something horrific may be happening to or dangerous happening to Ruby through the glass is another possibility. Then we get the date, which we already know, May the 11th, dropping at midnight in the UK on iPlayer and then later on that day in the early evening airing on BBC One. Around the world at exactly the same time it drops on iPlayer, which is uh, a better time for some countries than others. I've made a video about that. And finally, we get a cheeky wink to camera, breaking the fourth wall. If this is a musical episode, I think that would fit really well because musicals often break the fourth wall, especially during the songs. So maybe we're going to get a bit of a, hey, they've just finished singing or they're just about to go into a song. He gives a little wink type thing. And yeah, that's all of the new things we're going to get. I'm sure we're going to get much more in the extended trailer that we're going to get apparently this coming weekend. So let me know what you think of all these clips in the comments down below. I'll see you soon. Goodbye.